Thank you. Chris, Greg Moore, Arizona Republic. It's a tough loss. First of all, I'd like to ask, how's the tailbone, man? Are you okay from the fall? Uh, yeah, I'll be all right. I'm curious then about the energy and pace. Was it what you wanted to see uh, consistently throughout the game? Uh, not at all. Definitely got to be better. They, they came out and they were the aggressors. Uh, they sort of looked like us in game four. And um, they, they hit us. Uh, they were a lot. They were too comfortable. We got to be better. Next is Dave McMiniman with ESPN, followed by Dwayne Rankin. But sometimes you've got to hit your cap. Um, what do you make of Paul Gordon's night and then how he's been playing this series without Kawhi? Yeah, he got it going. You know what I mean? Like I said, he was getting his spots, uh, making shots. Um, uh, Twin and uh, Reggie got it going early. It gave him a chance to sort of settle into the game. And you got to make it tougher on him. Next is Dwayne Rankin with the Arizona Republic and then Jovan Buha. Yeah, Chris, you guys took the lead and then got tight there at the end. When you feel like you guys weren't able to do the, to do the We got to close quarters better. You know what I mean? Like, that's been a problem for us all series long is closing quarters. Those last two and a half, three minutes of quarters, um, you know, we took the lead, maybe cut it to one or two, and then they get a bucket, and then they go on the run. So look at it, see what we uh, need to do better, and get ready for the next one. Next is Jovan Buha with The Athletic, followed by Kellen Olsen. Hey, Chris. Um, they've actually stayed with Zubats more than, than playing small ball. And, um, you guys had outplayed their small ball lineups through the first four games. What was the difference in, in them shifting to smaller and having more success with those lineups? I don't know. I got to look at it. got to look at it. Um, we gave them a lot of open shots early. You know what I mean? They got their threes going, and I think that's a team that plays off confidence when they make a shot. So we got to uh, try to get the right people shooting, and um, our offense feeds off our defense, so we just got to remember that. Next is Kellen Olsen with Arizona Sports, followed by Gina Mizell. Chris, I know with your position, you take pride in getting DeAndre the ball. What were you seeing with the way the Clippers were sending bodies at him? Um, got to do a better job getting it to him. Um, get our spacing right, you know, knowing that they undersized. They got like three people sort of boxing him out or trying to hold him down. So we just got to pick our spots better and be more aggressive. Next is Gina Mizell with Suns.com, followed by Cameron Cox. Chris, uh, Monty, during his pregame availability, kept preaching kind of first quarter, first quarter, first quarter. And so I imagine that's what he was telling you guys too. So when it doesn't quite click in that first quarter, is how surprising or frustrating um, I mean, it's frustrating, but you realize it's a long game. You settle in. and You know, guys came in. We fought back. Uh, and, you know, it seemed like every time we get there or whatnot, they do another run or whatnot. So we look at it, like I said, and we got to come out better. Next is Cameron Cox with 12 News, followed by Sierra Santos. Chris, what's the mood after this one? Monty Williams, he just said that you guys are going to be better next game. I mean, is that what you guys talked about right after this? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, um, we know we're going there, a uh, place where we won last time. We know they're going to be excited and ready to go. So we will be ready. Final two questions are going to be Sierra Santos with Fox 10 and Dwayne Rankin. I asked Monty about desperation. I, that's not really something that you guys can practice. He said that you guys really aren't going to need to practice it anyway after getting your butts kicked. What do you think the response level is going to be like in in L.A.? Uh, we'll see tomorrow. Um, yeah, that's why you play the games. We'll see day after tomorrow, you know. Final question is Dwayne Rankin. Because you guys have been so good at protecting the ball, and then tonight only did the 14 turn, they turned that into 23 points. Yeah, was that? yeah, that was uh, uncharacteristic of us, you know, especially me. I had a couple turnovers early in the game, first, second quarter, and uh, they converted on all of them, you know. So, like we said, that's that's uncharacteristic of us, and we got to be better game six. Thank you for the time, Chris. No problem.